Good morning. I stood in this exact spot yesterday and cleaned up, I don't know, about five or six of those thrown in the exact same spot. Um, this has got to be the same, the same DB that, um, that put that, I mean, it's only, look, so, there's the can, and where we go, that's the trash can, just right around, I don't know, 20 feet away, 25 feet away, there was a bunch over here yesterday, I guess he only came in here and just had enough to buy one beer yesterday, but, I mean, you have got to be, you've got to be something else to be able to pull your car up right where my truck is sitting, get your drink on, and go, I see a trash can, I see another trash can, I see another trash can, and I see another trash can, but I'm going to throw it on the ground because uh, I don't have any manners. And I don't want to say that you weren't raised with manners, because that would just be speculation to say that. So I'm not going to say that. But you definitely don't have manners. You have none. That looks old, though. That may have come up with the water. So I'm not going to I'm not going to rattle off too much about that, but that guy this natural who makes this? Is that Anheuser Busch brewed? But what what I don't care. That is hands down the number one beer can that I find in this area. And not just this area. I I see them it's got to be the cheapest beer. Whoever makes that, y'all make cheap beer. And your clientele they don't have manners. Because they'll buy that stuff and throw it right out. One of the things that's starting to uh, scare me, though, is this trash can right here is starting to flow out of the top of it. That's not good. But, just one beer. Oh, wait a minute. There's, uh, there's somebody's apple juice. Um... somebody's lunch bag or something not much though and but like I said before it's the cold weather that's keeping uh, the litter bugs from flying uh, I can I can deal with one beer I'm a yesterday when I came in here there was a a squirrel that was laying over here somebody had shot it in the face and killed it and just left it there it was fresh because when I picked it up and threw it off into the woods, um, it was still limp. And it was 28 degrees when I was here. So somebody just pulls up here and it is hunting season for squirrel. But if you're going to shoot an animal, utilize that animal because you're just a monster if you just kill an animal for no reason. Those are fox tracks right through there. That's pretty cool. I threw it off into the woods in case someone's wondering why'd you throw it off. You could have just left it there. There are kids that come down here. And uh there's McDonald's. And kids don't need to see that. Kids probably aren't down here now because of the cold weather, but still. They don't just need to see a dead animal. This clearly shot in the head. It's not like it fell out of the tree and bumped its head on the way down. I don't know how many squirrels that that actually happens to. But, uh, there's some of these trash right there. But other than that, the park ing lot looks halfway decent. So I probably won't even need to break out a bag. I can probably just throw it in this trash can here. I've been bagging everything up and not utilizing the trash cans here because I want to keep them as empty as possible for the patrons that come down here. Um, but I think I can get away with doing it this time. 
Okay, it's cold. Um, so I'm gonna get started, which is only gonna take me a couple minutes. Something's running off in the woods right there. A deer, I've been seeing so much deer. I will say that people not coming to the parks because of lock gates or whatever, the, uh, the wild animals are out and about. So I should probably shut my mouth. The guy's boat isn't out there stuck in the ice anymore. That's cool. Um, hopefully it's not at the bottom of the river. But I don't see it anymore. So that's cool. A person got their boat out. That's awesome. All right, y'all. Thanks for watching. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. And, uh, and have a good day. Have a good day.